Hi guys, most welcome back to in our the new lecture. Now we are continues with the table view. In the last section we discussed about the some of the property about the table view. Now we are the discussing about the how to set the data on table view from array list yeah from dynamic now just to move on the table view dot system i am creating just here the sample array list variable name array now i am uh, some of the setting the me data Now, how to set the this table data according to this one count? Now, first we want to this one is the our array list. We want to set the number of rows according to array list. Now, remove the seven names array dot count. Means we already discussed about the array list uh, how to count a number of uh, items in the array list. now count now next thing is our how to set the data from the array list to in pls of this one text now select array this one names array of you see here just our right function table view ui table view cell for uh, row at index path this index path uh, what is this index path index path means you can say that just first index 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 this is the index path you select the first means the zero index path second item means 1 0 to 1 for me this is the index path this time now i am setting the index path dot is particular we are counting the row Row a uh, table uh, name array dot count now particular row share the item row check and verify hey it's working you can see the uh, image view name uh, uh, image view name you can share the also the image view dynamic you can set the image you also dynamic now we are just creating just we are downloading some of the sample images and uh, showing how to set the dynamic image view now just cute image already uh okay i we want the seven images okay images five Yeah. 
Now we have the here seven image. In some of the project, we have the more than twenty images, more than fifty images. Now this time, how to manage the images are in separate directory? How to manage the images in separate folder? Now we'll discuss in the next lecture. Continue with the next lecture. to so how to manage the images in the separate directory and how to share the images on table view